What is up, you guys? It is me, Brayden A, B A S, whatever you want to call me, I don't care. Uh, today, we are going to be reacting to The Big Pig Break, um, which is another piggy episode. Uh, I will react to Brayden A shows. Uh, I'm just focusing on piggy since it's a little bit newer. Uh, so, yeah. Um, we did these episodes a couple of days ago, so if you guys want to go <laughs> watch those, it's about, you know, Bo Pig rekindling her relationship with the pigs after the birds tried to mess it up, as you guys already know. Uh, yeah, it's 9 in the morning, I just want to get this crap over with. I, well, I, I mean, I'm not saying that in a bad way. I'm not saying that in a bad way, y'all. I'm just saying, I'm you know, not in the best, well, I mean, I'm a little bit tired, not gonna lie, but um, I'm keeping myself up. I need to get my sleep schedule back on, but this is not about me, as you guys know. This ain't about me, so um, we're just gonna get into it. Um, if you want to watch any of the Piggy episodes, go look at, at the Piggy playlist on the screen, Piggy BAS spinoff. Um, but without further ado, you can watch the new one we just put out two days ago. But, um, yeah, let's react to the Big Pig Break. This is, in my opinion, the funniest Piggy episode out of the 11 we have so far. Of course, there's more to come. But this is the funniest Piggy episode. I think ever it's an hour and ten minutes long so it's a very gonna be a long reaction um <laughs> but of course you know i'm all up for those long reactions uh this one was released a couple months ago as you can see i'm actually gonna click like on that because it's just so funny november 8th yeah it's been it's been a few months so let's just react to this all right so okay the big pig break if you guys you know want to watch this that's what it's called but anyway without further ado let's get into this episode uh it's got it's a long one for sure uh so yeah i hope it's recording my audio let's just go three two one let's go you know what i'm tired of this mustache pig we're gonna make a stand for once okay today guys we will be having a piggy meeting Ooh, a piggy meeting oh uh, also I'm so sorry, guys. Oh I'm not wearing God. a bow. But to make it seem like I'm different, I'm going to wear this. And we're going to pretend like this is a bow for now until I can find a bow. Okay, I'm just going to... I'm just going to... I'm not going to try to pause too much because this is a long one. But, God dang it. I'm really going to try to find, like, uh, a bow for bow pick and keep it on every episode. Because I've have, I've been having troubles ever since day one of Piggy. <laughs> That was almost a year ago. September 5th. That was almost a year ago. So that was the day we started Piggy, by the way. But good God, I need to find a bow for her because we have, like, a bunch of moving situation going on. So that's why it's hard to even find anything anymore because we're all just losing everything. But, uh, <laughs> just, you know, bear with us. But anyway, I'm not going to try to pause too much because this is a long uh, video. See, look at that. Look how long that is. We still have a long way to go, so let's just, let's just not pause too much. Why don't you have a bow? You're literally called Bow Pig. Why'd you take it off? Because we can't uh, find them, King Pig. Uh, it's none of your difference. Um, no. None of your none difference, of your really? <laughs> you know me, Bow Pig. I lose my bows very easily. Okay, well, anyways, guys. Piggy me. Leave it all alone. Wow, Plain Pig. <laughs> well, wow. Well, that's guys. Just... Yeah, piggy so, meeting starts now. You know, every single time we try and steal you. Okay, everyone falling off. Yes. Yeah, but my bow keeps falling off. Okay, but but we're not focusing on this right now. You know what? I'm keeping your bow. Every single time we try and steal the eggs, things go wrong. We always fail. We fail all the time. We're like planting in the secret formula. Oh my god, you figured it out. Wow, I, I, I wouldn't have never guessed. Wow. I kind of noticed that ages ago. Yeah. Well, guys, today... I really hope y'all can hear break. this. I really hope yeah. so. We're taking the day off from stealing the eggs. Because... After I left it. Fun fact, y'all, I literally tried to do this, like, months ago, but it ended up not recording the audio. Either that or it's not sounding good, so I really hope you guys can hear this. I really hope you guys can hear the video, because I know you can hear my audio, but can you hear the video? The last time the problem was is because of my headphones, but anyway. A feeling. You need a break. So yeah. You time to rest for your big win. And maybe 
think of some good plans. Yeah. Yeah, so basically this uh-huh. episode, basically this episode, they are basically taking a break from stealing the eggs, and then the birds are like, no way, they're not, because they always do every episode. So yeah, that's basically the plot line, this little the setup for this episode, so, just, you know. Well, that's kind of smart within itself. Turn on captions. Maybe go to Chef Pigs. Go to Chef Pigs and get some food. Yeah. You'll hook us up. He knows us. We're friends. We've been friends for so long. I really. <laughs> we're gonna introduce Chef Pigs soon. Just don't. Just just don't worry about it. I'm I'm really trying to introduce as much people as we can because. Back then, back in like 2011, 2012, yeah, early 2010s, uh, me and Chelsea, we really collected Angry Bird plushies like crazy. Because Angry Birds was a part of our childhood. That's why we have so many plushies. I know it may not be as big nowadays, but back then, 10 years ago, 11 years ago, it was pretty, pretty popular back then. So we like to collect these plushies and kind of want to get back into it because, you know, I mean, we have Piggy now. Uh, because, you know, we, us four, we always kind of like playing with stuffed animals. Uh, as most people may, may would, uh, because, you know, you just gotta keep these things, these little charms in your adulthood, but anyway, you know what I'm saying. Oh, well, that's a smart plan. Hey, uh, Bopic, I've noticed you've never really came to steal the eggs with us. I mean, I know we're taking a break for today, but it starts in a few seconds, but I just have a question. Why don't you ever come to, you know, um, get a, you know, get to steal the eggs with us? Oh, you know, Bo Pig. Bo Pig don't like taking risks. Okay, so the reason why she's do the reason why she's saying this is because like you know she like the team girly girls at the time she was really feeling the friendship, uh. But they ended up using her. If you guys uh, watch episode eleven and episode ten, you will you'll understand because episode six, episode seven, episode eight, and episode nine, Bo Pig had a uh, helmet pig uh, keeping a secret. In episode nine, helmet pig spilled the beans and then. You just go watch it for yourself. It's really cool. You know? Yeah, I really don't like taking these risks. I like staying at home and watching the dogs. Someone's gotta do it. Well, I guess you're right. Someone does have to watch the dogs. Yeah. Aww. Yeah, guys, we're taking a break. So, you won't be seeing the birds today. We're not gonna have fight scenes or anything. And also, I will get my crown soon. Had to get my phone. (laughs) Sorry. That's why I didn't speak for yeah, a Yeah, I noticed that. You haven't got your crown revamped yet. Hey, hey, uh, Fix-It Pig is still gonna get it revamped. Oh, man. By the way, y'all, King Pig's crown kind of broke again, so we'll have to make a new one. <laughs> okay. It just, it takes... If you watch episode 11. I for a crown to be made, you know? You gotta get the metal and the ironing and the... All that correct. Yeah. So, yeah, yes, Bo Pig, you don't even understand. Process, people. But yeah, we're taking a break starting now. They're pretty legit. Mom might be still in bed today. So guys, what do you say? We go to the beach. Ooh, I want to go to the beach. Who all wants to go to the beach? Of course you want to go to the beach because you're both big. <laughs> Who wants to go to the beach? Me. 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 Uh, oh, um, I'm sorry guys, you got to stay home. I don't want you guys biting anybody and us getting lawsuits. I mean, I'm sure they're 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 more well behaved than some dogs, right? Oh, they look really soggy. I know they really do. You know what? Yeah, I this is just kind of sad. You don't have to do that. No, it's my pleasure. Okay, I'll do it for you. Of course, she oh. says. Oh, it's my oh. pleasure. Okay. Oh, oh. You want plain pick to watch? Wow, you guys are like you guys are like the landlords of the house, aren't you? What? They're kicking us all out. Oh wow, they really want to stay home by themselves. Wow. It's, okay, well, it's nine ten. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right, let's continue. Sorry, I just had to. I just had to say that. Sorry. Fine, you guys could stay home by yourselves, but don't let any birds in. Yeah, that seems like a good rule. Don't let any birds in. Yeah, don't let any birds in. Anymore. Yeah, and don't go to their house either. We're taking a break, remember? Oh. Exactly. Uh, and guard the house. Why would they do that, case, though? You know, you never know any of these robbers, you know. But, I mean, what 
do we even have to rob? Well, good. <laughs> that's actually that's actually fair. Good point. Good point. Well, there's no there's not gonna be any robbers here. There's nothing we have. Yeah, floor's pretty empty. Well, I could try to steal the dogs and hold up for ransom. Yeah, that's, me, that's a thing. my fake bow. All right, guys, let's go to the beach. Be safe, uh, dogs. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, he's waving by at us. Bye, buddy boy. Bye, buddy boy. I keep forgetting you're his owner. We'll have a backstory a few episodes in. I'm just, I'm spoiling too much. I'm sorry. Wow, just, they really just want to be home alone? We have, a, we have a lot of things planned for Piggy, by the way, so just stay tuned on it. I guess so. Uh, <laughs> I think Buddy, I think someone, one of the dogs did it. Buddy girl. <sighs> God, that was disgusting. Like what you did to Helmet Pick? <laughs> sorry. Now it's time for the birds. Blackbird. It's been a really hard time to get through this. They froze all of us. Iceberg did. Oh, yeah. He froze all of us. Yeah, and, um, they're, they're nowhere to be seen. This was right about the time when, uh, Iceberg and Frank and Fatbird had actually, um, you know, packed the crap and, uh, moved to that cave. Uh,. So yeah. But why are you fun fact? Are you worried about them though? Well, I mean, they're still my babies. You know? They are, but they've been running with us forever. It was about time they moved out. I know, but it's they're all on their own now. What's going on, mommy? Oh, it's nothing. Hello, Daddy. Hello. Sounds like freaking Mookie. But I don't know how to do any other baby voice, so sorry. I can't believe Mommy Red is still feeling bad for Iceberg and Frank and Fatford after everything. Well, I mean, she's a mom. They're I mean, what jerks. more? What more can they you forced say? They me to do stuff I didn't want to do, like the W plant. You gotta think though, like W plant. You gotta think though. Uh, Mother Red is, or Mother Red, or Mommy Red. Uh, I'll have a name for her, kind of like how Virgo has his name, Virgo, and we call her Mommy Red. I'm, I'm gonna try to have a name for Mommy Red, kind of like what we did with Virgo, because it, you know. But what more can we say, though? I mean, she, of course she'll feel bad. It's her kids. I mean, come on. I can't say it on YouTube, apparently, so the W plant. Yeah. You guys know what I'm talking about. Not right. It's not right. Remember when they did that, and it's been forever, like, parents. Terrence's depression. <laughs> well, what's up, Terrence? Nothing much. Just, you know, depressed. Well, there's not much to do. I mean, it's just unfortunate, and in so many ways. Oh, I'm just scared. They're not going to make it out in this world, Virgo, and I don't even know where they are. Well, I mean, they're doing a pretty good job so far. Seriously, you should not worry about them. Maybe they got a house. They got a job. Oh, yeah, house. they totally got a house. <laughs> about it. They're not going to make it out there long. Yeah, they're going to come crawling back to us. Just you I know they will be, but I'm just, they're still my babies, and I remember when they hatched Virgo, and I would have never thought they would have been this bad. Really? Oh, okay. You right, guys right. keep it down over there. I'm trying to watch Charlie getting arrested because he was driving blindfolded. There, it's an SML reference. Hey. Because at that time they released Charlie gets arrested. Pretty cool. That right, son. You're my butt slip. So be quiet and let my butt slip more. <sighs> Sorry I interrupted your Charlie, green bird. That ain't even important right now. It's just my babies. I'm just so afraid. You know, you know, mom's always afraid. Exactly. She's just being a good parent. Why is that serious? Hey, Blackbird. Mm -hmm. Remember what we talked about? Yep. Okay, good. That's good. 
yeah, they're the black masks, by the way. Just a little fresh reminder. Uh, we'll have more with them in episodes. What am I telling you? Stay tuned. No, surprisingly, I haven't heard that much from them ever since we talked to them. Yeah. Maybe they finally are going to do something out in this world. If I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure we have a scene with Frank and Fatbird and Iceberg by the end of this. I love how Baby Ray can already speak, like, everything in the <laughs> Okay, we went over this in episode three. Well, well funny. Well, Grumpy Hatch first, but Baby Red is talking a lot sooner than you would expect Grumpy to. That Wait, really? <laughs> yeah, I'm not. He's going at his own pace. What's a few few? Oh, my babies are gonna grow up soon. Can't believe it. Well, can't believe we already have people moving out. Yeah. You know what's kind of shocking, in my opinion? I'm going into college soon, and I'm somehow... Oh, yeah! We're having story with that, yo. Yeah, Yellowbird right now, so far, out of the, all the 11 episodes we've had, Yellowbird... <laughs> Yellowbird... Yellowbird, a.k.a. Chuck, uh, because, you know, that's his actual name, according to Rovio. Uh, well, we haven't seen him the past 11 episodes, and, of course, he's a very underrated, kind of forgettable character throughout these 11 episodes, but he will be prominent later on, so, and he will be notable, he will be whatever you want to call, maybe relatable to some, you know, people. Well, you'll have to see once we get there, because... Episode 12, which will be next week. Uh, I, I'm thinking about doing it every Friday or every Sunday, like how we used to do it. Maybe every Sunday. I'm thinking about it, so. I'm not related to these people, and they're already moved out. And I'm older than them. I'm in my freaking 20s. What am I still doing here? I need to go to college. And this is Yellowbird's, like, pressure, kind of. Think well, about it. Oh, Yellowbird, I wouldn't be rushing it if I were you. Yeah. Life's hard out there. I know, I understand, bro. Soon enough, you'll be paying the bills for your own house. Oh my god, are they paying bills? What are they gonna do? Dude, they're really not gonna make it out there, Virgo. They won't. Well, they don't have to pay bills because they're in a cave. So they, that's it's like a cheat code. If you don't want to have a house, you live in a cave, like a caveman. It's a cheat well, code. I'll be coming back in a week. I'll give it a week. God, I'm just so ashamed of them. Blackbird, I used to not be this bad. I don't know what's gone into them. Yeah, they used to be nothing like that. We used to just... Yeah, they would... They would be... P.P. houses. <laughs> P.P. houses? Yo, 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 hold on. Do y'all see this? P.P. houses. Wow. <laughs> anyway... I don't know why it's doing that. Yeah. And I saw it firsthand. It was scary, and they and you made you blow up. And I know you didn't want to do that. Twice, technically. If you think about it, in episode two, call uh, a Piggy the Chase, uh, Ice Bird had made uh, Blackbird blow up uh, Virgo's car because he was provoking him, and a police car, and almost killed King Dice. Pretty tough adventure. Also, I pause at 11-11, so I'm going to make my wish. Okay, I made my wish. No. And I'm sorry for yelling at you for that. I didn't know that they made you do that. I'm oh, just trying to over it. And that's kind of how the Black Mass started, because they had a little heart-to-heart. -heart. Fun fact. Yeah. It's just scary. I know. Well, us sissies, what are we going to do? I mean, us teeny girly girls. What are we going to do? 
Honestly, I don't know. I mean, for those ice cubes, I kind of made a very banging, banging vanilla, vanilla shake from Starbucks. I guess this was before, really, uh, the Team Girl Girls had had, like, um, you know, met Bo Pig, or maybe they had known of her, you know? Also, I don't know about you, but I really like how, like, this episode kind of revolves, like, a little bit around, like, uh, Twitchy, Redbird, and the pigs. Like, I like how, like, I think, like, Twitchy and Redbird should be, like, a, like a, like a duo, kind of like Bluebird and Twitchy. Somebody's mowing. I don't hear that. <laughs> Somebody's mowing. But I really do like the, like, their duo. Like, I like how, like... Or was it really a duo, or is it like... I mean, it kind of... Yeah, it kind of is. Like, I like their duo. Kind of like Twitchy and Bluebird. Or, like, Twitchy, Bluebird, and Redbird. Like, I like how, like, they team up and spy on the pigs. Like, I like that little setup there. Nice. You know what? Now that you pointed that out, they're all just sitting over there. And why are the dogs just at their home? Well, listen, Twitchy, you don't have to stress about the pigs all the time. I mean, that's all you ever do. Yeah, that is yeah, true. Yeah, they could try and steal from us any second. Why wouldn't you be? Not, why, why would you not be stressed about it? But they're doing their own thing. Well, yeah, but they could be plotting. Yeah, but doing their own thing the usually, eggs. yeah, it usually always means they're going to come here and try to steal our eggs. We know this. But you can't tell me that's not suspicious. Look, they're crowded in a circle. They have to be <laughs> Twitchy's making a crowd around her. <laughs> yeah, I do admit it is pretty suspicious. I'm not even gonna try to make the reference there. Don't don't even make that reference. Well, I do admit. It's just nothing. Like that's all you ever do is stress about the pigs. You need a break sometimes. Yeah, and besides, there's better things to worry about too. Yeah. Like what? Worrying about Icebird and Frank and Fatbird? Who cares about them, Twitchy? Honestly, I don't care about them. In fact, I'm glad they're out this house. Yeah, they were a menace. They were a menace to this house, weren't they, Twitchy? Yeah. That's all they ever were. If you want to know what they're talking about, go watch episode 4 of the Halloween special. That's when they got kicked out. I mean, true point, but... Well, um... Still, I feel like there's better things to worry about. That, that, that could just be me, but I don't know. We were such no, it's definitely not just you. I don't know what's gotten into them, Blackbird, and that's been puzzling me. That's why I said I was depressed. It's been puzzling me all day. Yeah. Me and Iceberg used to have fun getting headshots on Call of Duty, and now, ten years later, this happens. Ten years? Well, I guess it's not totally inaccurate. <laughs> I don't know what's gotten into them. We used to play Angry Birds, like like off camera, like not filming. So we're kind of basing a lot of that story on the piggy. I don't know what they've been doing. Cause you know, piggy had some backstory behind it. You know, like we had originally, you know, me and Chelsea, we usually like originally played Angry Birds all the time and we're basing the story on the piggy. So piggy's had some backstory. You know, it's not just, oh, we started filming them. No, we've been doing this for since like, for like 11, 10 years. But it's bad. It might have gotten into their brain. Yeah, and I never used to actually believe that video games would cause violence, but knowing what Frank and Fatbird and Iceberg did is crazy. Especially Iceberg. He froze everybody like he hates us. Yeah. And to be honest, I don't care about their Team Badberg bullcrap anymore. Yeah. And you know what? I'm glad you guys are making a stand because I wanted to leave a long time ago. What's, what's the point in being a bad bird anymore? Because the, but them doing that made me realize, you, you, we don't need that. We don't need that in life. I feel like everybody on Earth should really try to be like these two. <laughs> yeah, we need to spread positivity. Exactly. Wow. Wow, that's really shocking coming from you guys, actually. 
Yeah, and just a month ago, you guys were talking about TPing houses yesterday. Mm, yeah, but we've learned a lot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yesterday. <laughs> we learned a lot since then. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. That is funny. I don't know why that's funny. I just find that funny. Yeah. I've matured for a lot from today, from last year. And now they're saying last year. <laughs> like, <laughs> make up your mind. <laughs> All right, well, anyways. I laugh at everything. I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah, guys, so come chow down on this. It's really good. Uh-oh, what did you make? Um, shrimp alfredo? Yep. Oh, it's the best. Twitchy, I love their shrimp alfredo. Oh, me too. You know what? Yeah, this episode doesn't actually take a comedic turn until a little later, so that's why I said it was funny, because it, it gets funnier later. I'm gonna come grab my plate over here. Twitchy, you wanna come grab, grab your plate over here and just watch them? You, you go first. You go first. Uh, uh okay. I really like the duo. I really yeah, do. Keep them. I think they should be in uh, future episodes. <laughs> I feel like someone needs to. I mean, they're guided around in a circle. I guess what you're gonna spend your whole day doing is watching them. Like, There's no point. You in could it. be doing so much better things. If they come over here, we'll mess with them then. You don't have to waste your day on them. I understand, but we're the Angry Birds. Better to catch him before it starts. Our eggs are more important. Really, the pigs can just insult him, being like, "Yeah, you guys have no life." Kids, I've hid my eggs under a patch. That's why they're not over there by Grumpy, and then that's why you don't see any eggs right now. I've hid them all the way under there, and I got a heater down there for some for some of them to get the heat. As a ball, that does not sound like this is safe to say. <laughs> Dude, they are like. He got a point, though. They are so unsafe. Well, I'm just trying to keep my baby safe from those pigs. But I really don't think you guys should waste your whole day. You need to eat over here or with the family. Besides, after all the things that's happened. Please. Kids, come over here, please. Honestly. Bunchy, what are we gonna do? What? Maybe they're talking about taking a break of that Kit Kat bar. Okay. I feel like that's an underrated Redbird moment right there. Kids, please come eat here. No, we, we, we gotta, we gotta, um, I heard some muffling in the garage. Oh, okay. Well, go check on that, I guess. Mm, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's a good excuse. Alright, Twitchy, I think this hill is a good place to hide. We have to climb all the way up here, though. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Maybe their dogs don't see it. I don't think their dogs can see Okay, it. so we need to make a list. Yes. So We're making a list. We're checking it twice. Some of us should get, um, maybe a knife. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some of us should get a fresh patch of grass we can eat there. Oh, yes, that would be really good. Um, can you pick a mustache pig? Uh, well... King Pig, um, I'll get the grass. Mustache Pig, I'll get the beach towels. Wait. Wait a minute. Hold on. King Pig, um, I'll get the grass. Must I'll get the grass. Did I miss something? Mustache Pig, I'll get the beach towels. You know, I just want to be helping. All right, all right, good, good, good. Oh, okay. okay um, how about this? You can carry all the heavy stuff. Okay. Oh. Um, Maybe, maybe they're, let's see, what would they need a fresh patch of grass for? Some heavy stuff. Towels. Towels? 
in they're gonna, chairs. They're gonna carry the eggs in a towel. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if they broke. And they're gonna have a fresh patch of grass. That way, when they dig a hole to come into the nest, they can cover it up. Yeah. And then the chairs. So they can relax when they're finished. Yes, yeah, so they can have a break. And they can have a they can have a chair to eat the eggs on. And they can have a and they can have a cup holder. You see? You see or an egg it's, holder in this case. It's all coming together. It's yeah. An egg holder. Coming full circle. Wait. In this case. It's all, yeah. all coming together. It's yeah, coming full circle. Alright, so we think we mostly have everything arranged, right? Yeah. I think I'm going to get some travel games. Oh, yeah, yeah. Travel games? We need to get a GPS to make sure that we know we're going in the right place. Okay, I genuinely think this is the best Piggy, the best Piggy episode, in my opinion. Oh. I know, I know I've already said that, but I think this is the best, the funniest. I love this one. We need to, we need to have guidance. I think we're going to go somewhere. GPS? <gasps> what if they're gonna go somewhere, they're gonna, take her they're eggs, gonna, and they're gonna trade it with someone? Uh, yeah, they're gonna take her eggs, and then they're gonna go somewhere. And they're gonna get money. And then they're gonna, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're gonna get money. We, and I got, I got messages, sorry. Hold on. Okay. Cause they're poor. We, we have to go tell her to go. Cause they're poor. We have to go. Let's come go. on, come on. You guys are over exaggerating. My kids, just launched herself in the house. We're, we're busy, we have to tell you We're not busy, we're eating like you guys should be. Well, what do you eat plenty an hour for? Now we really need to tell you something because it's really important. It's really, 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 really important, Mom. Really, 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 Pigs aren't bothering anybody. Don't worry about them. Why are you defending them? They're... <laughs> Yo, no way did you just say that. tried to steal from us several times. I'm not defending them. I'm just okay, saying. Okay, no, I do agree with Well, I'm just Frank, saying. Frank, you're not defending them. I'm just saying they're not bothering Wait, them. Wait, I thought they were saying the same thing earlier, though. Nobody right now. They're doing their own thing, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, seriously. Me and but Twitchy heard a whole other story. Thing me. Me and Twitchy heard a whole other story. And we need to tell you right now, please, before this goes any further, before you're going to do something else. Oh, yeah, all right. Let's, let's hear it. Okay, let's hear the story. Okay, you won't believe this. I believe that the pigs are going to go take our eggs and they're going to trade it with somebody to get millions of dollars. And because they're poor, it makes sense. Because they mentioned a patch of grass, so this is how the plan's gonna go. Okay, so they're gonna bring a towel, and then they're gonna break into the house, they're gonna steal the eggs, they're gonna wrap the eggs in the towel, and then they're gonna jump back into the hole they made, come out of the hole they made, and then put grass over it. That way it looks like they didn't even do anything. And then they're gonna go, and they're gonna travel. They're gonna make the giant egg stock. Yeah, that'd be a good episode idea, actually. All the way to somewhere else. And then they're going to take the eggs, they're going to give them to someone, and then they're going to get paid, and then they're going to use that money to get them some food, and then they're going to eat the food, and yeah. <laughs> that was a lot to process. I mean, <laughs> My exact reaction. The last part up, but you can just imagine that that's what they're going to do. What they're going to do. They're going to trade it with somebody. <laughs> you get, get, get a word out. And they're going to get rich. They're doing it for money. That sounds... Should we go oh. check what they're doing for ourselves, or go? You know, we'll just do this. Who wants to go on guard duty? Guard duty. Wait, guard guard squiddy. Duty. I want to be on guard duty. Guard squiddy. All right, well, you can be on guard duty. Yay. Um, yeah. I, I can't choose since we're here. Yeah. Good. Good. Good call. Okay, so you two are on guard duty. If you see the pigs come over here and plant any holes or something, then. Yeah. Yeah, do that. You need to watch for them and let us know. 
Okay, can do. There, now you two can calm down. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. I still think we should. I think we still have a whole other story behind this. I think we're right, Twitchy. Wait, really? Are they doing that? I believe so. Me and Twitchy believe so. Alright, now stop stressing about it, okay? Go finish your dinner. Okay. Yeah, eat first. The food's gonna get cold. It's more gonna get dry. Yeah, my plate's already cold. Well, Redbird. Can't believe it. They're still talking. They have to I, I, I won't rest until we figure you know out what? what they want. Twitchy, we're gonna stay up until they go back home. How about that? We stay up until they come home, and when they start coming towards this house, we will know when to get everybody up. Yeah. We will set an alarm. You know, we'll get a motion sensor light and an alarm. We're gonna have... Twitchy, I think we have some in the garage. We can hook it up to the house. Like a pig sensor. You know what? Let's go to the garage. Here. Here, I got the pig sensor. Everything will... <laughs> Why didn't they use this before, though? When a pig comes, this thing will start blaring and beeping throughout the whole house and wake everybody up. Blaring and beeping. Everybody up. So we're gonna stay up. Dawn, dusk, we don't care, Twitchy. Rain or shine, we don't care. We're staying up until the pigs come back to their home. Because we want to make sure that they don't even come near our house. Yeah. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Alright, so if we're ready to leave now, I'll call us a taxi. A taxi. Okay, we'll should we get a, a GPS just to make sure we know where we're going? Yeah. Okay, sounds good. Hmm, what are they doing? They're, they're using a phone? How'd the pigs get a phone? phone? Wait, they're what calling somebody. What are they using? They don't have a phone. Wait, exactly. that is true. Did they steal one from us? Oh, maybe they did. Maybe they're calling the people. Mm, yes, hello, is this the taxi show? He got the pizza guy. Was it the pizza guy again? Yeah, it was the pizza guy again. Yeah. Um, That's a good one. Did you see that? He looked at her house, and they're on the phone. They're, what if they're going to hire someone to steal the eggs? That is true. They're going to hire a hitman. I see what they're doing. Okay, let's get a little closer. Yeah, we should. Here, let's get in between this bush. Yeah, hide here. Mm -hmm. All right, all right. He's on his way, so now we wait. Yeah. Okay, and I got the GPS from the store right across the street. Alright, perfect. Wait, why is she... Oh, she's holding a GPS. They're gonna go somewhere, and they're gonna hire a person, and we're gonna think that they're, the pigs are gone on a vacation when they're really not, because they hired somebody. Some solid logic right there. Butchie, that's what they're doing. I have a pretty far-fetched idea. What? 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 <laughs> All I can really wonder with this is that have they ever fit? Did they? I can't speak. Did they ever finish their food? <laughs> app it says they're gonna be here in two minutes. Yeah, alright, alright. Hmm, 
two minutes. We can pull that off. Okay, let's go find this Kaizu, I guess. Okay, we need to go find... They're, they said they'll be there in two minutes. We have... Okay, so I'm almost sure. I'm pretty sure the comedic part... The comedic parts of the episode are coming up. Two minutes, Twitchy. Alright, um... Do you see anything in the garage? Oh, uh, let's see. Um... There's this thing. Uh, I don't know. That's not really anything, is it? You know, we, we could still use this. We could yeah. still use this. This could be our car. Yeah. Our car, yes. Yes, the car. And then they can... The lid. Let's see. Um... I don't know. That's not gonna work. Wait, what about that big one? Big one? <laughs> <laughs> now that... Now that drawer is just used for my clothes now. <laughs> Maybe that's... Yeah, well, oh, things changed. Off. Oh, gook. It says we'll be here in 30 seconds. 30 seconds? That was quick. Okay, to be honest, I think Redbird kind of pulls that off. He looks like some celebrity. Look at my hair, Twitchy. Yeah, look at that. That could be my hair. That looks like a freaking, that looks like an 80s hair or whatever. You know, you, you know what I'm talking about, you know? Like, like a really like a famous painter haircut. That's what he has going on. This can be my <laughs> <laughs> but this is just ridiculous. Twitchy's hair is ridiculous in this one. I remember that. Look at my flying. <laughs> look at that. It's just, it's just a bunch of cords, bro. Twitchy, I look like I have one of those one cuts. I look like Dora the Explorer's cut. <laughs> Dora the Explorer. This is so dumb. <laughs> Oh my god. And Twitchy's hair is ridiculous. It's just a bunch of cords and wires. How did they not fall? Oh, I, I think, Jesus Christ. Look at my hair. That actually could pull off, Twitchy. Yeah, we're taxi drivers. Alright. Yeah, we're taxi drivers. Wow, my hair is Okay, five seconds. The real taxi driver gets there. That's true. Um. Jesus Christ. PlayStation. Um, oh my god. Strawberry shortcake. <laughs> this is just so dumb. <laughs> it's dumb in the greatest ways. Beep beep. Oh, Ooh. that's some really fly hair you going on there. Oh, thank really fly hair you got going on there. That rhymed. Thank you guys. Um. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh gawk. I'm just I, all I can really think about with this is how the heck did these pigs not fall for that? Like seriously. Yeah, we we. It's a very old car, ain't that right? Uh, yeah, this is one of her. <coughs> yeah, this is one of her older models. You see. <laughs> Oh, you have some really wacky hair going on there. Oh, uh, yes, I had, I, had, I had a bad hair to eat. Oh, yeah, this is one of her older models, you see. Ah, this is so... This is so ridiculous. But meanwhile, my hair is looking really fun. Meanwhile, my hair is looking real fun out here. See this? It looks like one of those Dora the Explorer haircuts. Oh my. Okay. God. <laughs> All right. He said it again. He said it again. Well, where are you off to? 
and we're going to the beach. Oh, oh the, the beach. beach. Yeah. Oh, why, yeah. why, why, why would you be going to the beach? Yeah. Well, why would we question it? Mm, yeah, that's kind of weird that you want to know a person. <laughs> True uh, point. I mean, oh, 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 okay, the beach. Twitch, the beach. Oh. Wait, how are we going to drive this car? We can't drive cars. Uh, let's just pretend like we know how to. Um, uh, crap, I'm in the driver's seat. Uh, okay, the beach. Not reliable. <laughs> Not reliable. Not <laughs> reliable. Liable. We're the most reliable. Wait. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> what do you mean the most reliable? <laughs> Makes you look like a freaking serial killer. <laughs> And why was it chicken biscuit? <laughs> well, Mustache Pig, maybe that other taxi driver was like the birds or something? Oh, yeah, it was definitely those pesky birds. Man, I had a hard time with them. What about you, other taxi driver? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty not like them. <laughs> my, hair, my, 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 my wig is just so natural. <laughs> my wig? He just admitted it's fake. Uh, looks like you're not even staying in your lane, Mr. Taxi Driver. Oh, this, I, you know, I just started my drive. <laughs> so when she's like, no, 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 no. I just, I just started driving not that long ago. I just got this job that like, long ago. I'm still rusty. Ain't that right? I got this job not that long ago, but I'm really rusty. Oh, come on. And they had to pull us up. Crap, I hope Virgo and Mommy Red don't know this we're driving a big taxi on the road. Maybe no one has to tell us. Yeah, maybe. Oh, you know what? I need to pull out my GPS. Wait, why are you pulling out a GPS? I have one in my pocket you can use. Oh, well, I want to see what professional as possible, Twitchy. Oh, uh, sure, sure. Yeah, GPS, yeah. Thank God it's only five minutes away. Here you go. God, we're driving really slow. Yeah, well, 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 well you see, we, we just got the car tuned up, so we, we, we kind of need a, um, 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 we kind of need uh, to go slower on this road because. Yeah. Uh, I'm genuinely surprised. Oh, I mean, I'm, I'm really kind of. I, I really shouldn't be surprised that the pig would fall for this. <laughs> you seem very unsure. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you seem very yeah, unsure. Yeah. And it's just kind of weird, though. Like, taxi drivers don't come here often. How come one pulled up as soon as we got out? It's uh, kind of weird. It's kind of weird. Hey, a taxi driver, weird. I want to tell you about a story. Apparently, these dumb birds that we live with or whatever, guess what? We're taking a break. From stealing the egg. I know you don't care about our story and our personal life, but since the beach is only five minutes, it's nice to have these conversations. Take that right, myself. No. Yeah, small talk. In fact, we really appreciate it, don't we, other taxi drivers? Uh, uh, yeah, we definitely appreciate that. <laughs> nudge, nudge. Now, now why, why, what, what made you decide to take a break from this egg stealing? But well, what's such pig? Since the beach is five minutes away, we might as well tell them about our life for whatever reason. Hmm, no, I mean, you know, gotta spew you a little. <laughs> Reference? Well, we like to do it all the time, and we always fail, so I feel like we should just take a break. Yeah, it's about time we have a break, we work ourselves so hard. Well, now, Twitchy's thing is pointless, we have our answer. Oh, I. Yeah, they can't. They can't. They have to be caught. <laughs> 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 that was very violent whispering. <laughs> that was very violent whispering. You gotta get it out there. 
<laughs> the door of the explorer. <laughs> God dang, this is comical. This is the best episode of Piggy, and I will say it till the day I die. <laughs> mm-hmm. or you see, um, yeah, you see, being a taxi driver is hard. Yeah, we just had to make sure we didn't crash into anyone. Or... And then that's why you do Uber, kids. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like, got... yeah, we're we're basically here. No, we're not. We haven't even moved that much. We haven't even moved like zero point five centimeters. Oh my god. And they still fall for this. They still fall for this crap. They still do. They're like, oh, we only moved 0.5 centimeters? Oh, no. I think this is an accurate taxi driver. Freaking ridiculous. You know what? That's what I love about this episode. It's just that the ridiculousness, this little setup. Twitchy and Redbird is a great duo to be spying on these pigs. The pigs taking a break. Original. Everything about this episode is flawless. Can you, can't you just drive yourself? He's changing voices left and right, and these pigs are like, oh, I- I'm not even realizing it. Wait, what are you talking about? Wait a minute, must this be? No, I noticed that. We what just... is that beat? Uh, nothing. Uh, not- uh, look, I have a trunk now. You can't say that. I have a, I actually have a trunk. So what are you, Ella? Well, anyways, we're close enough. We'll just walk the rest of the way. Yeah, thank you. Please, God, thank you, God. Twitchy, they're finally up. Wait a minute. How do you? How can you say that when they only move zero point five centimeters? Freaking car. Oh my God. Let's, Twitchy, let's drive home before they notice. Wait. Actually, that my hair was my fake hair was actually looking pretty fly. It really was. I thought it was probably just a setup. Maybe they got suspicious. Maybe they're actually still plotting something. I. S- why would they take a break? Uh, out of one day, suddenly, why would they take a break? Yeah. Um, yeah. I definitely don't see how that people. Like... Yeah. Why would they still take a break though? That's just weird. How they all of a sudden want to take a break out of one day of the year. I think we should follow behind them. Yeah, maybe suspiciously. You know, let's get out of the fake taxi. Oh, oh, I can see it from the distance. Oh, this is going to be so relaxing. Wait a minute. Mustache pig. Look, another taxi. Oh. Hold on. Create some snack, create some fun at snack time. Easy cheese in your favorite. Oh my god, that's it, really a taxi? Yeah, we. You, this is how you know our budget is hella low. <laughs> um, they just drove off. Wait a minute. You know how on the app how it says the license plate of the car? That was the exact same license plate. <laughs> that's funny. Maybe but it was wait. just a taxi driver driving Wait a minute, the one that we just drove didn't have a license plate. Oh, that's kind of suspicious. Eh, uh, well, we're here anyway. Yeah, let's just enjoy it. Yeah. Oh, so nice. Oh my gosh. Look at those pine trees. I know. Pine tree? Oh. <laughs> it's windy out there. Wow, okay, so they're relaxing in the beach chairs. Hmm. Wait, wait. Okay. Like yeah. Let's hide in my fake hair. Okay. Well, is that fake hair? Or is that just... <laughs> 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 oh my god. No way he just said that. No freaking way. <laughs> Is that fake hair moving? Oh yeah, because f- fake hair moves. Jesus Christ, these pigs are gullible, man. 
I love this episode so much. This is why this is my favorite episode. We need to have more episodes like these. Trust me. Hopefully, they are coming soon. Um, Especially after all the story so ones we've been just, doing. I just got there. And why is there something sticking out of it? Oh, maybe it's a drink bar thing. It just could be a drink bar. Maybe it's like a smoothie. Yeah, smooth smooth. <laughs> Maybe it's a smoothie. <laughs> Maybe it's a Swiss smoothie. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's a Swiss smoothie. Maybe it's a Swiss laugh at everything and that's that's what i love about this sh I, on my channel i rewatch my videos all the time that's what i just love about my channel is that we just love to laugh at everything and we just it's funny uh, great now we have to act uh you want some smoothies would you like a smoothie <laughs> Timothy, if he was on helium, honestly. Well, hey, Master Pig, maybe we should order some smoothies. Yeah, we want. We want three, four, five smoothies. Five smoothies. Oh, uh, what flavors do you recommend? Oh, vanilla. We want one vanilla smoothie. A banana. Banana smoothie. I would like a chocolate smoothie. I want. This is just downright making me thirsty. This is this is just downright makes me want a smoothie. A pumpkin smice. <laughs> <laughs> a pumpkin smice. Jesus freaking Christ. <laughs> so it's freaking funny, bro. I can't. I just can't. <laughs> a pumpkin A pumpkin smice. <laughs> I can't talk either. Emma <laughs> <laughs> says, Pig, what would you want? Ow, I got bit on my hand, unfortunately. I would like your peanut butter smoothie. Peanut, yeah. peanut butter smoothie. Peanut butter? Um, uh, Twitchy, what are we gonna do? We don't have any of that. This ain't even a smoothie stand. All right, just, uh, give me five seconds, please. <laughs> um, all right. We have to go to the store and buy smoothies. Yeah, okay, let's go to the store here. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, sir, we would like, uh, five smoothies, one peanut butter smoothie, one vanilla smoothie, one chocolate smoothie, one pumpkin spice smoothie, and one, uh... Banana <laughs> smoothie! <laughs> <laughs> red for those <laughs> 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 Adam, he could have wrapped that whole verse if he, he if he just got the banana smoothie. Banana smoothie. Yeah, wow, that was a long pause. Okay. Okay. Uh, all right, we're shuffling all the drinks. Here you guys go. Bye. 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 Why would they Why would they fall for the smoothie stand right there if they already had a smoothie shop? That's just kind of okay. These pigs, man. These pigs are dumb. Okay. Here, here's our drink carrier. Oh, 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 thank you. All right, guys. I don't know who the dumbest pig is, to be honest with you. Oh, wow. They literally they literally poured all the drinks in here and combined it together. Oh, that's not very professional. I mean, but, zero star rating. Yeah, me too. But, hey, we still, it's still drinkable. Ew. Home, so we, we need to go. We, we need to go. I think we should... Smoothie all over us. Oh, yes. Oh, God. Oh, so messy. <laughs> 
<clears throat> you know they're doing that on purpose. Also, what did that say? Transforms into characters. If you flip that over, it says transforms into characters. Wow, I don't even know what that goes to. Sorry, smoothie guys, even though I'm, I'm gonna give you guys a really low, low rating. Maybe we should think of tomorrow's... Our budget is crap. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> what did you just say? Come on, Redbird, you know downright what they just said. They just said, we should see what tomorrow's plan is to steal the eggs. You already know what they said. We have to stay over here, right? Yeah, okay, well, how about we just stay over here? Because they're going to get smoothie all over us. Because they're pigs. They're really, like, they're messy. Yeah, there's the piggish people. Yeah, let's just hide over here, okay? Yes, we need to think of it. Yeah, let me go throw this over here. Yeah, me too. I think it's going inside my eyelids. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna wake up with smoothie in my eye. Jesus Christ, Redbird! Did you need to go into detail? It's gonna be stained inside our plushie. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Stained Maybe inside our plushie. Wow. Biggest fourth wall like breach ever. Brain oh, frick. Oh, frick. The funny part is coming up. The That's funniest part of the episode. Really smart. And the brain machine can control this the is the funniest part of the episode coming up. Control the birds. The funniest part. It's coming up. You know what, Twitchy? Do you have your phone? Wait, actually, no, we can't let them know that we're all the way at the beach five minutes away. <laughs> they're like the team bad birds. Like the freaking team bad birds. Yeah, literally. You guys are stupid to the level. Hey, where did the smoothie stand go? Maybe they went out of business because of your low star rating. Well, true. Yeah. Or maybe it's a food truck? Or a smoothie truck? Yeah, maybe. Even though it didn't have wheels. <laughs> wheels. <laughs> wheels, 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 wheels. Well, whatever. I don't care about that. We should care about the eggs. I feel like my idea is pretty good. But does anybody have any other ideas? You know, just for the sake of it? I say yours is a pretty good idea. To control us? That seems impossible, though. <laughs> yeah. I have a really smart scientist. <laughs> Okay, I have to replay that. I, ha I have to replay that. This is the best part of the episode. That uncontested, probably the best part of Piggy. The best Piggy moment it has to be right here. This episode is the best it is the best like you can't get any more than this you know what i don't believe that yo that's all you know who's really in the way that black bird a black bird's so annoying i know right that iceberg oh my gosh he beat us to death yesterday yo i'm so glad i heard he ran away Ooh. i heard him and frankie Pepper ran away from a rumor if they're mad a rumor? Who's spreading those? Do you think maybe we could team up with them? Yeah. You know? I had completely forgot about that plot line. <laughs> and find out where, and buddy boy and buddy crew, they have I have to think about that one. You know, I, I think that maybe you could in the future. We'll just have to see. The future of Piggy? I'm telling you, great things are coming. Our senses, and they can find them for us. This is this part's sad. This part's just so sad. I believe that for a second. They wanted to be home alone. 
I call my coke. I don't think so. I mean, they wanted to be home alone, plain dick. Uh, are, are you sure? Yeah, I, was, I even dared to even just wash them. I like this party scene. Hold on, I gotta take this. Hold on. Hold on, just a second. I'll pause in a second. Hold on. <laughs> Sorry, I had to, I had to, uh, I had to take a voice message. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. I'm sorry, guys. I just had to pause for a second. I was actually watching that today. I was watching the new child, uh, the Braden A show episode. It's really funny. I was, watching, I was actually watching that today. This morning, actually. <laughs> Alright, anyway, let's continue. This is a long party scene, man. Jesus, they even grabbed Uncle Skits in there. Yeah, they're probably sad. They probably. I miss Uncle Skits. They miss us. Or, or, or. Well, yeah, they probably miss us. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, maybe we should run a whole house. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, yeah, oh, well, maybe. <laughs> I was saying maybe we could rent that old that hotel over there. <laughs> oh, yeah, we could do that. It's only thirty dollars and it looks actually really good. <laughs> yeah, I'd be laughing if it was actually thirty dollars, cause there's no way in hell. Yeah, why well, do you guys want to get off that topic? <laughs> yeah, we were just like, oh, we we probably miss it so much, and then you were just like, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, they they probably do. Yeah. But then again, they volunteered to be home alone. What else do you want us to see? Again, McCall and Coken. They even chose to be home alone, Blimpick. Macaulay Cook. Wait a minute. But back to what they were saying about bringing Faber and Iceberg. They heard from a rumor. What rumor? From what? I was literally saying that earlier. Yes. Who else would they? Who else? Who else would they would have heard it from? The That's person what I was that saying. they're trading with. It all. I wonder when they're gonna show up. I just wonder. I'm just waiting for it. Oh. <laughs> How about we go inside the hotel room and have a nice night? I mean, it's already 9 p.m. Yeah. Can we at least stay in the ocean for five more minutes? Be a plain pig. You. This is giving me very, uh, this is really, this is giving me Florida vibes when we went to Florida last year. Fun fact, that was almost a year ago, and I'm kind of surprised. And I don't think we're doing it this year. Yeah. Unfortunately. No, uh, you guys can. Me and Mustard Pig. We'll, we'll, we'll. But it is giving me those Florida vibes. Go back to the hotel room. Oh no, they're leaving again. Wait, Homer Pig, are you coming to the hotel room? Yeah, I'm going. Okay, we'll, we'll be there soon. What if we dressed up as room service? Yeah. Okay, we need to get there quick. Okay, let's go. Alright, um. Alright. Yeah. You know what? I'm bringing back the, the fake hair. Yeah, good idea. And if they say it looks similar, I'm doubtful they'll even remember it. Yeah. And that's gonna. I'm gonna make my hair like this. And it should be unrecognizable. Okay. Oh, okay. Darn it. Does anybody have the key? 
Okay, well, it's room service, and I see that you guys have a problem. Oh, they just showed up randomly. You guys have a definite serious problem. Oh, um, well, actually, we don't, because it turns out most of people have the key stuck in his ear hole. Yeah, all my key was stuck in my ear hole the whole time. Yeah, ear hole. Yeah, we're gonna unlock our door. What would you guys like in room service? Uh, no, we're only gonna be renting here for like two days. Two days? Mm, maybe we should. I just real. Oh wait, yeah, Twitchy just made her uh, feathers like that. But that is so. How the frick? Oh my! How did the pigs literally not fall for that? That is crazy to me. <laughs> Yeah, for five people, you know? Yeah, yeah. For five people. I mean, yes, but I figured you guys would have did that already. No, we haven't. We're finding out these context clues. Like Twitchy said in episode three. Yeah. The parking lot looked almost empty to me. Yeah, that's why we even chose it, because it's not as crowded. Oh, well, yeah, 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 yeah,
<laughs> These pigs, man, they're just like <laughs> taxi drivers. Oh my god. <laughs> I do think it's really funny though. Look at that part. That was unexpected. Like, like I need popcorn. This movie's really rare. <laughs> what does it mean? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing's even happening. There's just complete static on the screen. <laughs> this movie's really weird. <laughs> oh, man, that's funny. What's that? What's that? Say, was that you? This episode's just so random. Wasn't that one of your squeaky floors? <laughs> What's that? Maybe it was. Squeaky farts coming out of his mustache. That's probably a survival series reference. I'm not sure. Oh god, they're coming in the kitchen. They're coming in the kitchen. <laughs> it's like making us look so. It's like making us look so. It's the loveliest thing I've been going on. It's not haunted, Plankhead. I have to rewatch that part. I have to rewatch that part. I just have to. They literally blew their cover. <laughs> it's not haunted, Plankhead. Just go to bed. Wait, it's <laughs> They're like, go, 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 go. In the bathroom and sleep. <laughs> in the bathtub? Can, can I sleep in the Can we both sleep in the tub? Yeah, let's just sleep in the tub. How do you have room for that? God, I don't want to deal with them. Well, you're going to have to. God. Might as well be scared with you guys. <laughs> oh my gosh, the room is haunted. <laughs> it's haunted. Room service. God, we can't come out. Besides, I have to get my wig ready and everything. No, oh, it's okay. Your hair's fly. We'll be fine. Something's told me we're gonna be here for a while. I hear something. Ugh, well, we promise you guys, it's nothing. No it's probably bad. like the pipes and the vents or something, because vents have pipes, right? Yeah. Right, yeah. Vents have pipes. I don't think they have pipes. I doubt they have pipes. They literally don't. <laughs> It's probably not haunted. Besides, if it is, I'm giving it a one-star review, and we'll make this business go out, too. Yeah. Just like we did with the smoothie service. Do you really believe that crap? Alright, we really need to get out of here after watching. It's almost 10. They're, gonna, they're probably already wondering about us. What do you think? Definitely. Alright, here, we'll roll out. My neighbors are being really noisy at 10 in the morning. <laughs> Wait, Twitchy, how are we going to close the door? Um, it's going to make a bad noise. All right, let's just close it and run. Oh, Bob, what, what was that? Oh, my God. Okay, did that, did that door just open and shut? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, okay. Guys, you're just seeing stuff. Just seeing stuff. That door opened and shut. We need to get out of here. You have no reason to talk. You weren't even in here. Yeah, did you see that plane pick? Now I actually believe you. Oh my god. This room is haunted. This room is haunted. Oh my god, guys. We wanted to have a nice time here, not a scary time. Uh-huh. Maybe we should just go ask if we can have another room. Yeah. We're gonna have to get room service. <laughs> That's ironic.
Here, let's just yell out the hallways. Maybe well, I know we're probably gonna wake someone up, but we'll just yell in the hallways. Room service. I know it's ten at night, but room service. We gotta go. We gotta go. Right, we're at the hell tour. The the hotel. Door. <laughs> The hell door? Yeah, we're at the hell door. Yep. <laughs> also, there's a piece of bubble wrap being blown away outside because it's really windy. <laughs> the hell door. The hell door? The hell door. Uh, I'm just talking fast. We're at the hotel door. Let's go home, please. <laughs> the hell door. <laughs> I thought this was a good one. Oh my god, they monetized. Oh, whatever. Yeah, we're just going to go home. stories. I love it. You guys mean uh, nothing. We just, you know, if Frank and Fatbird and Iceberg did something to Redbird and Twitchy, we would do something about it. You know, like good siblings do to other good siblings. Yeah. Once again, I feel like, you know, people need to be like them. Uh, I guess that's good and sweet. But Virgo, I'm getting scared. Does anyone know when they left? Yeah, which was like 6.30. They've been gone for like almost four hours. <laughs> what if, what if Frank and Fatbird and Iceberg did something to them? Maybe not. Can you guys shut up? I'm trying to sleep and dream about Charlie being unarrested. Bailed out. Alright, we should go now. Alright, we need to knock. Wait, is that them? <laughs> babies? <laughs> really? You're still calling babies? Wow. What a mother. We're home. Hello. It's Why does it look like you just ran a freaking marathon? Uh, well, uh, needless to say, me and Twitchy were running laps getting exercise. Really? Because I don't think that... You guys were doing that for four hours? I mean, we never... Have too much oh, exercise. Yeah. Oh, we ran too much. Oh, yeah, I guess it's true. Here. Tubi would know. Wait, hotel? You guys went to a hotel? <laughs> <laughs> what? No, we didn't do that. No. Hey, why aren't you guys like spying on the pigs or something? Well, now that I'm just remembering this. Best excuse. Wait. They say they went to bed. But, Blackbird, how come? How come I see a bunch of flashing lights and dogs dancing? R, 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 They They threw a party, didn't they? But wait, why does it look like there's just dogs there? Once again, people being obnoxiously loud outside. And where are the pigs? You would think that we would see some pigs in there, too. Hmm. Wait a minute. Dogs having a part? That's not right. That never happened. Hmm? Yeah, you think? Should we investigate? Hmm. Maybe I'm going too far. But dogs partying sounds really weird. Well, guys, we should go to bed. Yeah. You know me and Virgo like to get our sleep around 1030, don't we? Yeah. So, kids, y'all should do the same. Besides, Bluebird, you have school tomorrow. Oh, I have school tomorrow. But I need to make a case. Oh. Should we go in investigate, Virgo? Not Virgo. Should we go investigate, um, freaking fat bird and iceberg at the cave? Oh, yeah. Um, uh, you know what? I, um, I just realized I left something out there. Um, I'm gonna go get it. Well, you guys, you guys better come back in like five minutes. <laughs> oh, I'm scared of my children these days. God, everybody's going up and everybody's leaving the house and they're always going to be gone. <laughs> Ain't that what you want? I'm just a worried mother. Maybe I need to do it over some sleep. Here, can you stay up a bit more to make sure... Do it over some sleep, just worry in your dreams, you know? 
That's what we all like to do. Pretty relatable. <laughs> That was a sweet transition. Hold on, hold on. That was a good transition. Did y'all see that? That was flawless transition. That's underrated. I gotta look at that one more time. You zoom into his eye, and then it comes back to Bluebird's eye. That's great. I like that. I talk. I did this over the weirdest stuff. It's ten thirty-five at night. Bro, wake up. I'm starving. I think we should enter inside the house and sneak in and get some snacks beside the plate. Maybe everybody's going to bed. Yeah. Hey, look. You know, the lights are turning off in the house, like the windows. Maybe we could sneak in and get some snacks or something like how we did last week. Did Elfrank attack them? Yeah. Do you think they're even worried about us? I don't think so. We've been really Haven't we been gone for like a week? Oh, no, they are. They definitely are. Mo at least Mommy Red is. You know, there's still, you know, back when we did live there, these people would still stay up until 11, but that's like the latest. Everybody's usually in bed. Besides, Greenberg's usually done watching. Yes, 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 yes. would notice and you know we don't dogs what are they gonna have dog treats no. yeah that's true dog treats. hey dog treats are actually good <laughs> well we're gonna do that soon sneak in that's what we're gonna do well this is definitely a new chapter in my life I wonder if Blackbird and them were really serious about Team Backwards and leaving. They could just come join us out here. They don't need them. Yeah, why don't they do that? I actually hate that stupid Blackbird. Yeah, Blackbird's stupid. Blackbird's a wimp. Yeah, I'm just here. Yeah. Blackbird's a wimp. Maybe we should shoot him a text. Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, we'll, we'll think about it. Okay, we're back. Yep. Wait, is Mommy Red already asleep? Oh, yeah. I'm about to be. I was waiting on you guys. Wait, is it really 1040? Yep. Well, good night, Virgo. Good night. Wait, he's already asleep? Wow, that's nice. Well, it looks like everybody in the house is going to bed. Wait, Twitchy. I know you're really tired, but you can't go to bed yet. Oh my god. No freaking way. There ain't no way these are 
freaking ant on my phone. I'm sorry. Hold on, guys. I probably freaking got bit a million times because I'm on the floor. Don't ask me why. I'm just reacting to it on the floor because I can't. I'm not gonna tell Twitch. Anyways. Maturing. Yeah, you can't forget the black mask. What? Well, Blackbird can't be maturing. He's part of Team Bad Bird once, once upon a time. Yeah, but he once, quit. Once you're on Team Bad Bird, you, 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 you stay a villain. Yeah, that's literally their bio. <laughs> right? Haven't you noticed that with Suit Space Red? Once you're a Team Bad Bird, you stay a villain. Oh Think about doing this for a future episode. Yeah. Just stay tuned on Piggy. Some things will be happening, baby. That's what we like, yay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, How are the pigs gonna be able to do that? I don't know, it seems impossible to us, but apparently they know a really smart friend. Yeah. I think we should really just be on watch out. They could strike at any minute. And we don't want him to do that. I mean, I, I do see where you're coming from. You know what? I'll be part of Watch Out since I, since I did volunteer today. Mm, yeah. Me, me too. Yeah, Blackbird will be too. How oh, about wait, so us four will be on Watch Out? If the four of us could just keep our eye out on the pigs tomorrow. Yeah, if we can just keep our eyes out, because... Hey, you better keep your eyes out. Do that <laughs> crap yeah. Sometime. And if anything seems wrong, and if they seem like they're gonna come into the house and catch something, then we need to tell the parents about it. Yeah, we need to do that. Yeah, if we feel like anything suspicious is gonna happen, we need to tell the parents. All right. Okay. Sounds sounds pretty good. Right, yeah, sounds solid. Yeah, good night. Good night, guys. I'm getting zoned. Good night. Good night. Good night. Oh, gawk. The sun's coming up. It's like 7 a.m. Yeah, I haven't got any sleep last night. Because it's haunted. Me and Plantic haven't got any sleep. Look at the bags under our eyes. No, let's not even worry about calling. <laughs> oh, I think we should just walk. Alright. I mean, it's only ten minutes. It'll probably be like an hour compared to walking, but hey. What can you do? Turn. You call another taxi and then have more shenanigans. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait, but they said they weren't having another taxi. <laughs> Me and Plain Pig didn't get any sleep last night. We were just thinking about how this place is haunted. Well, we're leaving today. Or actually, no, right now. Yeah, I'll just go ahead and pack up and leave. Coming here was a bad idea anyway. I'm giving it a bad review. It'll be out of business next week. I'm so glad we didn't get possessed or anything. Yeah, I'm just kinda glad. Yeah, we could have gotten Wait a minute. Or anything. Wait, Mustache Pig said that? I thought he was on yeah. <laughs> said that it wasn't haunted. Uh, I'm just kinda glad. Yeah, we could have gotten on we, we, we could have been ghost food. Oh yeah, me and Playbit were up we were up all month. All night last night, weren't we? And me too. Yeah, we were scared out of our minds, guys. Look at the bags and grass.
guys. We're tired. We need to... We're gonna... I hope we don't pass out on a bench or something. Because I'm tired. Let's just go. <laughs> the captions is literally like R R R R R R R R R. What are they pirates? <laughs> I like the dogs. The dogs are cute. That is some possessed like sleeping. If anything, that's possessed. You guys sleeping all good. You know, they probably slept the whole time we were gone. Yeah. They probably were gone crazy. Heck, they probably didn't even miss us. But that's okay. <laughs> they were dependent. Yeah. Oh. Oh, I, mean, I guess they're really tired. They really knocked this might be my. Hard. I think this reaction might as well be my longest video. <laughs> Yeah, probably. They probably cried themselves to sleep. We have like less than a minute. Hey, Larry, guys. Well, me and Plainfic are gonna go to bed. It's actually kind of sad, though, with them crying themselves to sleep. That's. That's actually really sad. At least we're safe at home. Well, I want to go to bed in an actual bed that's soft and I don't have to worry about being possessed by ghosts. <laughs> well, for the last time, I don't, <laughs> I don't have to worry about Okay, that's fine. I <laughs> To this episode, man. I guess it was haunted. This episode. Oh, good man. night, piggies. Good night, folks. Night. And tune in on November 14th, which is next Sunday. Goodbye, piggies. Goodbye, Okay, definitely the best episode of uh, Piggy. That is the best. Uncontaminated. That is the best episode it had so many funny moments from the um what was it the uh the twitchy and king pig one oh they have to have a really smart scientist friend to be able to do that did i mention we have a really smart scientist friend that is a notable notable line um the i like this episode is like all over the place but in the best ways possible. Like, it is dumb. It is the, the dumbest episode, but in, like, the best ways. Because it's just so weird how, like, the pigs are just gullible throughout all of it. From the taxi drivers to the uh, smoothie machines and the hotel room and their Twitchy's dumb haircut. I just... I have a soft spot for this episode. This episode's awesome. I'm giving it a 10 out of 10. If I had to rank this episode, it'd be an S tier. Uh, this episode is, like, the definition of Piggy. Like, if, you know, like, if, you know, like... This might be the most notable thing on Piggy. Like, if, like, I was watching Piggy, I would most likely tune into this episode. And, yeah, I had originally done a reaction to this months ago, but it ended up not recording. I think it didn't record the video audio, it just recorded mine. Again, I'm still kind of pissed, but I'm glad I was able to do this. And I swear to God, if it did not record this one, I'm going to scream and never watch this episode again. But that would be unfortunate. It was unfortunate that happened, because this is the best piggy episode and i will say it until the day i die like honest to god and i like the sneak out too i really like the sneak out um it's a very good one as well um my favorite episodes the big pig break definitely the best i i, I keep saying that but it is the best and i'm pretty sure this reaction might as well it's probably longer than this the chase <laughs> might as well. I think it might be the longest upload on my channel, to be honest. But I've I've enjoyed every second of this. Uh, the last part of uh, the Frank and Fapper and Iceberg thing. I mean, it wasn't as you know. I mean, I liked it. It it it, it was it was okay, but it wasn't as you know, good as like the scientists and the smoothies and the taxi drivers. I love that. 
like this is like piggy this like this episode is the definition of piggy them i mean they're not stealing the eggs that's like literally the exact opposite of what they're doing and that's like the whole face of piggy is like oh the pigs try to steal the eggs but they end up not getting away with it that's the whole face of it but they're not doing it in this in this episode and it's weird because this is the best episode the big pig break episode five i don't know why but this was like peak piggy right here and the sneak out was also a favorite of mine i would have said this was also the best one I, I've kind of had some mixed ones. The Crown Catastrophe one. I was thinking about one day if when, which when we have like enough Piggy episodes and we're more in depth. I'm going to rank them all. Uh, which I definitely will do one day, but I'm not going to do that until the far future. But yeah, uh, this has been reacting to the Big Pig Break. Uh, AKA, I would say, the best Piggy episode we've ever done so far i mean who knows there could be a better one that me and chelsea do um but we'll just have to see it's, it's, it's for the future um i really love this one though top tier anyways that's all i'm gonna say Bye bye guys brayden a out